Hi there! Over the last 10 years I've been training people with little to no interest in using a programming language, such as R, people with a special interest in language, such as philologists, linguists, translators or even psychologists. The usual arguments for them being repelled by the perspective of using a programming language for their endeavors revolve around them not wanting to become programmers or never having a talent on using computers. And these arguments are totally understandable, but at the same time they are also very easily disputable. The reason is that using a programming language does not require a special talent or an interest in programming per se especially when it comes to using programming as a tool for efficiently analyzing language data. Moreover, using commands of a programming language does not transform you to a programmer that needs to constantly prove their corresponding skills. Clearing out of the way any misunderstandings as to the myth of having to overcome a big difficulty in using a programming language for language data analysis, the next natural question to answer is, why use R? R is a language with literally hundreds of thousands of commands for any kind of possible analysis that you will ever need in your research on a daily basis and that are available to use right off the bat. The syntax of the language is easy to follow and intuitive to learn and R's commands are always accompanied by detailed documentation. The documentation is also called vignette. Lastly, R is maintained and supported by a community of people who are ready to answer your questions soon after you post it. As we move along the video tutorials of this playlist, you will see examples of using R for solving real language data problems that you will be facing many times daily and you will then be able to appreciate its usefulness for a range of tasks, from cleaning and exploring language data to testing specific hypotheses and to building statistical models of it. So, I suggest you hope on and I assure you that you will reap the benefits in a not so distant future. Don't forget to also subscribe to the channel by pressing the relevant button on the video or on channel's homepage and then, in order to get updates when new videos are released, you need to activate the bell notification that stands on channel's homepage. 